What's up guys, Eddie from Harlem Bling and this is going to be a giveaway. Number one and number two, I'm going to teach you guys something very important. Something that really pisses me off being in this business of selling jewelry. This, along with selling brass and calling it silver or gold plated, this, all of that terminology that's fake, really gets to me. But first, I want to tell all of you new subscribers, follow my channel. All of you guys that are already following my channel, hit that like button. really helps me with my account. So, I have a wholesale customer of mine. He has a jewelry store in Atlanta, Georgia. He's like, yo, Eddie, <coughs> I bought this chain for a customer. He's like, you sell 200 gram chains for around 500 bucks. He's like, this guy didn't really want to spend so much. It's not the same quality, so I bought it from another website for 350 I'm like, listen, who did you buy it from? He told me a name. I'm not going to, I don't like to put people under the bus. This is the chain. He actually sent it to me. He wanted me to test it. So what's the problem with this chain? Let's not talk about the fact that it twists. Let's not talk about the fact that these stones are glued. They have no shine to them. The problem with this chain is hollow. This chain weighs 60 grams. It does not weigh 200 grams. I would advertise this on my website as a 60 gram chain and probably have it for around $200. He paid almost double that amount. Because they lied to him. On HarlemBling.com, we're all about being transparent and educating the consumer. When you walk into a store, or better example, you need change. You're at a bus terminal. You ask someone for change. You give them a $100 bill. They give you 520s. Are you going to count how much they gave you? Or you're going to take this, put it in your pocket, and keep walking? Listen, if you got them, if you ask your mother or someone you really trust, of course, you take their money, you put it in the, your pocket and you keep walking because you have a relationship with that person. If you bought from Harlem Bling already 20 times, and there's a lot of you guys out there, you could check my stuff, you don't have to. But if you're buying from a company, essentially what you're doing, you're taking this and you're transforming it into this. This is silver, which is a precious metal. This is currency. This is currency. You're taking this, you're transferring that into this. This and this is the same. There's labor in this. So this costs more money than the same weight of this. My point is you have to check what you're getting. There's companies that advertise Miami Cuban chains. This is from me. 10 millimeters. This is my chain. This is also my chain. They look about the same. This is flat. This weighs much less, so the price is cheaper. There's a lot of companies out there. They'll say 10 millimeter Cuban, have one white background, fancy photoshopped photo, and that's it. You get it. It's lightweight. So, what do you guys need to do? Whenever you buy jewelry from any company, make sure the listing says the weight of it. At Harlem Bling, we will have the weight listed. Some of the things will be as a range. So like rings, we're not going to put on the listing. A, seven, a size 7 is 8 grams. 8 is 8.3 grams. Well, right, it ranges from 7 to 9 grams. Listen, uh, uh, all jewelry... And I'm talking about myself. I don't know about other companies. It's handmade. Whether you start with a machine and then you polish it or whatnot, weight might vary slightly. And by slightly, I'm saying a 100 gram chain might be 98 grams, might be 102 grams. I would say up to a 5, 10% difference is fine. But if someone is advertising, a 200 gram chain and sends you a 60 gram chain, that's a scam. 
If someone's selling a 200 gram chain, sends you a 195 gram chain, listen, five grams of silver will not break the bank. So what I'm doing for this giveaway is these mini scales. These scales brought to you by Harlem Bling. We used to have them for $20. Now they're completely free. Completely free. There's no coupon. You just get it. Go on our website. Search for scale. You get it in. You have to buy your own batteries. You put your jewelry on it. And you know how much you have. That way, when you're exchanging this for this, you know you're not getting ripped off. I do not want to... Listen. I want all of you guys... <coughs> sorry. To shop with me. At Harlem Blake. I can't sell every item under the planet. I try. Right now, I'm wearing a 6mm rope. A figure rope. We just bought these in. We dropped a lot of new products this summer. There's still items that you want to find from somewhere else or buy it at your mall. Oh, talking about that. What I'm telling you now to get the scale, this is only for online sales. If you go to a mall into a jewelry store and they don't let you weigh the piece before you buy it, run away. Just bye-bye, have a good day. I don't care what discount you give me. I don't care how fly it looks. I don't care what I'm out. Listen, that's like you going in and trying to have some bum give you this, which is $80 for 100 and not letting you count the money. What are you going to do? Listen, I want my $100 back. Peace out. Or you're going to, uh, I'm giving you nice 20s. These are crispy 20s. Look how nice they are. When you have them in your pocket, you'll have a lot of clout. Are you fucking out of your mind? I'm giving you this. I expect $100 back. I'm giving you this. I expect the correct weight. Get yourself a scale on the house. Whether you bought something from us before or you fucking hate Harlem Bling or you'll buy something in the future or you're just watching this video and then going to comment below about i don't know how eddie shaved or about some stupid stuff a lot of your comments guys you write the most stupid shit you you don't think before you write that's a video for a different day get your scale completely on the house i'm putting the link down below until next time eddie from harlem Blend.